big shoes really to fill with guys leaving, but you know, I think we've seen some big growth from the guys in this. Somebody made the comment that actually kind of feel bad for the coaches because there's so many good quarterbacks. I guess I don't want to say you're all even, but what does each? I mean, you guys all bring something, right? I mean, all kind of different guys. Just how strong is that? I think it is strong. Um, you know, it's definitely a major asset for us. Um, you know, it's it's an asset for us as quarterbacks too. Just you know, having guys who've been in the game and then come off the field. And I trust what Joel says. I trust what Danny says, and you know, vice versa. So I think that's big. And you know, like we said, the competition just brings out the best in everybody. But it'll be interesting. Uh, I mean, not today I'll just say it was average. Um, you know, there's a couple drives we got to finish. Um, you know, and that's just all around, not necessarily you know, my position. But um, you know, I think we did make strides uh, throughout the spring. Definitely, just having you know, just the grasp of the offense. But at the same time, um, you know, I had some mistakes towards the end of the spring that I wouldn't have liked to have, and that's something that you know, I try to. Um, and my game is, you know, play mistake free. Um, so that's something that I can learn from in the summer and make sure I don't make the same mistakes in the fall. What's it like playing against the three four? So you've been here a while. I mean, you haven't played like against that in practice much. So what's right. it like playing against? It's different. Um, you know, we saw it with Stanford. Um, so I think that's a little bit of an advantage for us, just having seen it um, in the extended bowl prep. Um, but our blitz packages are definitely a little bit more extensive than, than what we had seen in the past. So, you know, Coach Aranda and those guys do a great job, and they try to make it as confusing as possible for us. But we just got to try to find some tendencies. Is it nice to hear that they were more vanilla? It's very nice, <laughs> yes. I think, uh, you know, our calls were definitely vanilla too, but it's nice not having to worry about, you know, you know coming all over the place. It's pretty wild. Yeah. Thanks, Kurt. I am. Um, you know, I'm excited about it. Um, that's the one thing, you know, I, I think – you know, as long as you have a chance to compete going into camp, um, it doesn't really necessarily matter how things come out in the spring. Obviously, you want to um, you know, do as best as you can. But just being able to be healthy and put in a, a healthy offseason, it's going to be a battle. So it's something I'm looking forward to and I'm excited about. Are you back to being able to work now? Absolutely. Okay. So you're hoping that when camp opens, you'll be able to drive the ball. Exactly. Yeah, I don't have any excuses, so uh, we'll see. <laughs> Kurt, the uh, battle at wide receiver for that number two spot, do you think Kenzel stepped up today and maybe this spring to be that guy? He did. He's somebody who's been making strides the entire spring. Um, Kenzel's always been extremely talented, but I think uh, you know, now that he's starting to get a little bit of confidence, you, you can definitely uh, see how you know, he might be a little bit of a different player and somebody that can be on the field for us consistently. Are there other guys in that group that, that surprised you or impressed you this spring? There are. Um, yeah, I think Marquise made some very big strides this spring. Obviously had a little bit of an injury there towards the end. Um, so, But that, we're expecting big things out of him. Um, in the off season, and then I think you know Chase Hammond continued to continued to impress whenever he got a chance to be out there. What do you feel you need to do between now and, and fall camp to be ready for fall camp? Right, um, I think just be more consistent. You know, the, the biggest thing for me this spring was just trying to be as engaged in the offense as I could and make sure I got everything down mentally. But the off season when all the timing and um, the consistency comes.